Oh, I was just about to start recording and look who shows up. That's fun. Very nice, shiny. There we go, caught it. I didn't know what ball to use. It was either a luxury ball or nest ball. Not nest, sorry, net ball. Well, that was fun. Let's stick it in the box. Moving on to the build, we have a Jellion build carrying on from our Evolution build because of the 7 star Eevee. With the electric type Terror and the held item Shell Bell to restore health throughout that raid, you can get that from the Deli Bro Shop of Lamincia. Eevees in special attack and HP, the modest nature, max IVs and everything except attack. We have the ability Vault Absorb and we have the move set we did change our move set originally it was fundable fake tears calm mind and charm we changed charm to electric terrain and then we changed fake tears to charm after coming against a couple of raids in testing that was putting us to sleep and this just nullifies that and it doesn't come at too much of a cost fake tears can't be used when the shield's up anyway so it's not a big loss especially if you're against the pokemon that removes negative effects a lot so we have a six star flying type snorlax here i saved this one just to show you like uh, the sleeping thing it can get annoying so electric terrain will be used very nicely here so we're just going to start it up and let's go two evolutions on the team so we're going to use charm turn one because he does have annoying attack and we have quite low defense is it just me or does it look like we can see under the raid so there's the first calm mind to put us on the plus one special attack and plus one special defense now this raid is going to be very annoying for us not just because of the yawns but snorlax has 110 base special defense while having 160 base hp so this is going to be really annoying and i can imagine it's going to be a long drawn out raid we get the electric terrain up so he can't put us to sleep he probably removes here, yeah, there we go. We're going to get the charm back up, use the second card mine, so we're on plus two, and then we go to plus three. And we're actually going to go to plus four special attack and special defense. Normally, I would only use two, sometimes three, but this Pokemon's going to be a nightmare for us. The electric terrain has gone, so we're not doing the 30% extra damage, but I'm not going to put it back up until he uses Yarn. That will maximize what we can do. So there's another Thunderbolt. We should catch up to the timer here, nearly. He's going to use Yarn here. Shield probably goes up. Yep, there we go. He removes negative effects. We're going to use electric terrain so we don't go to sleep. Now the question is, how much damage is he going to do here? Oh, he's going to use Yawn. That might have been the single most stupidest thing I've seen a Snorlax do. He potentially takes us out because we can't terrestrialize yet if he gets like two facades, if they do enough damage. Oh, we're on nearly max health. I thought we was on half health. Never mind. So he's doing about 100 damage. We're going to terrestrialize here and use Thunderbolt. We're doing the extra 30% damage. We're on plus four. It should do a lot of damage. We probably could have picked a better opponent to fight but with it being so difficult and it having yarn it kind of shows off all of jelly on strengths even when you're against annoying raids like this we do quite a big chunk to the shield he steals our terror charge only thing i don't want to happen is we paralyze him probably not going to happen he removes again for the third time this raid he removes a lot this might break the shield yep it does break the shield amazing so with a slow start on snorlax we are ahead of time right now i think the electric terrain will go here but we don't really need it it's just to stop the sleep rate Really. removes negative effects again for the fourth time he's crazy if anyone ever asks you who the craziest person is that you know just just say snorlax we do paralyze him with that attack so he's gonna do a ton of damage now let's see just how much damage he does over half when he's paralyzed but we're gonna finish him off we don't really need to worry about that and the snorlax goes down critical hit just to rub it in don't freeze this time i want my mystica and my ability patches that it's gonna give me there we go Two ability patch, two herba mysticas, bitter and a sour. We love that. Well, that was the Jolteon build. If you want to check out the Vaporeon build, I'll put it on screen right now. That was yesterday's build. Smash a like button if you have enjoyed this video. It does go a long way. Subscribe and turn on the notification bell if you are new so you don't miss any more builds. And I'll catch you on the next one.